Hey, it's Mitch. Two in the Cruise, May 18th, 1968. Miami Pop Festival happening at the Gulfstream Track at Hallandale, Florida. About 25,000 people attend. Bands featured included the Mothers of Invention, Blue Cheer, Chuck Berry, John Lee Hooker, Crazy World of Arthur Brown, and Blues Image. On Saturday, the closing act was the Jimi Hendrix Experience. The second part of what was originally scheduled as a two-day event, Sunday's concert was rained out, but there was at least one beneficial result. It inspired Hendrix to write, Rainy Day, Dream Away. The concert was promoted by Richard O'Berry and Michael Lang, later famous as the promoter of Woodstock. Six months later, Miami Pop 2 happened with a very Woodstockian lineup that included Procol Harum, The Turtles, Three Dog Nights, Steppenwolf, Junior Walker and the All-Stars, Paul Butterfield, Hugh Masekela, Chuck Berry, and many, many more. The first major festival on the East Coast, 100,000 people showed up for the three-day event, and no serious problems occurred. Isn't that nice?